Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe After Effects 2022 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create random movement for a logo or an image or a background or anything. How do you do that? Very simple. Before I show you, let me just show you what I'm talking about. Here's my little Happy Sloth logo. I'm going to hit space bar to show you what it looks like. And there's the Happy Sloth doing his little bouncy, bouncy, bounce. And it is randomly moving its position. Now, how did I do it? Very, very simple. Let me show you from scratch. So I'm going to delete that layer. And I'm going to delete all this stuff. You know what? The hell with it. Let's go right from the beginning. So we're going to create a new composition. Left click on new composition. 1920 by 1080 and 30 seconds. Let's just make it 10 seconds long. This doesn't really, really matter. The background color will be black. But these things aren't very important. The important part's coming up. Okay, good. Now, I'm going to zoom in. Ah, let's go a little bit. Okay, that's good enough. Okay, the next step is we've got our composition. Let's go ahead and get the image. So I'm going to use this one here called sloth.png. And it's just a cute little logo. And I'm going to drag and drop it onto the timeline. And it is too big, so I'm going to go ahead and grab this bounding box. I'm going to hold down the shift key to constrain proportions. And I'm just going to make it a little smaller so you can see it a little better. And I'll move it down a little bit. Okay, so we've got our sloth somewhere in the middle of our screen. Now, how do we make it move its position randomly? It's very simple. We're going to go make sure you left click on the um, uh, sloth or whatever uh, logo or image you're using. Make sure you clicked on it here in the timeline. Click on that little chevron or triangle. And then you'll get the transform. Click on transform. Same thing. And then you're going to see a bunch of options. Scale, rotation, opacity, position, etc. You want to now hold down the Alt key if you're on a PC or the Option key if you're on a Mac. Hold it down, then left click on the position. Left click there. What happens now is it creates what's called a, an expression. And you're going to see here it says transform.position. All you need to do is type in wiggle. This is one of the many um, expressions. Left bracket, and then I'm going to type in 2, 50. That's it. Okay, we can change those um, parameters, but what we've done is we've created a wiggle expression, and now when I hit spacebar, watch what happens. There it goes. It just moves around, and it wiggles, and it actually, it just randomly repositions itself. So that is how you create random movement very, very quickly inside Adobe After Effects. If you want to change that, you can left-click on the uh, expression like I just did here in the timeline, and then I could change this if I wanted to be a little bit crazier. Let's say I would go with something like, let's go over the top for 50. And then we're going to move, I don't know, we're going to move like 90 pixels. No, not 900. So what that means is it wiggles seven times per second. So it, it takes seven commands per second. And then it moves up to 90 pixels. And this will be way over the top. But let me show you anyway. There we go. He's just going crazy. Mr. or Mrs. Sloth is just going bonkers. But these are the two... Um, parameters that you can adjust and then you just dial it into whatever random movement you're looking for that's all there is to it guys and so inside adobe after effects for random movement thanks for watching ton more stuff coming up stay tuned